moment a lot of fans are talking about still this morning was the hit on Devontae Adams in the third quarter. Took a head-to-head -head, uh, hit and left the ball game on a stretcher. Uh, Pam was asking if you have any uh, information on how he's doing this morning. Wayne. Well, you know, our reports last night were that he was at the hospital. He had feeling in all extremities. Um, that he was being evaluated for a uh, concussion and a neck injury. Um, but he really, he was a, a awake and, and in control of everything and wanted to leave the hospital. I don't think he did. I think they kept him overnight. But nonetheless, uh, that, all of that's positive in terms of uh, Devontae Adams from a big picture standpoint. Football wise, we have no idea when he'll be back. Follow up on that. Eric wants to know if you think uh, the uh, player should have been ejected, the linebacker for the Bears, and uh, whether or not the league will be following up on that hit. Yeah, I think the, a couple of things. Um, yeah, yes, probably should have been ejected from the game, but you have to understand these plays are bang, bang, and the whistle had not sounded. From what I understand, the whistle had not sounded. That's why Trevathian went in with that hit, but he went in, lowered the helmet, and that's the thing they're trying to get out of the game, helmet-to-helmet -helmet contact, especially in a targeting-type mode like that. Should have been thrown out of the game, but I think the officials figured that, okay, they flagged the play, um, you know, and to them it was a bang-bang type situation and the whistle had not blown. Now, when you see that on, on replay and you're watching it at home and they slow down the replay, don't mm -hmm. they? It looks a lot worse. But when I saw it live, it was a bang-bang play, and initially I didn't think anything more than – the helmet to helmet hit, which we could hear up at our booth. And, and that was the thing yeah. that was bad. Uh, this question is from Tom. Uh, actually, more of a comment, just wants us to talk about the coach.